So I don't know what days I picked all these up, but we get them every year, so I thought I'd go through them real quick at the end of this video. Hopefully it doesn't make it too long, because we're already at the four minute mark. Uh, so a couple flyers we picked up. This one was for Samsung. Uh, special offer on Galaxy. Uh, this was a promo thing from My Case Builder. Um, uh, this has a promo code on it, so I'm going to cover it up. But yeah, basically, it gave us a percentage off on uh, phone cases. Basically, you can model your own case on their website, and they'll cut the phone for you and send it to you. Um, so you don't have to worry about doing that yourself. These I think I took out of the Day Zero bag because they're um, LG G3 things. Uh, just a little pamphlet. I don't think there's anything in it. It's just a little accordion style thing. Um, API Mission Control Accelerate Your API. I uh, don't know what they were about. I know we talked to them about something. Don't know. Uh, I'll have to look into that. Maybe I'll get back to you guys. Uh, something from AT&T about making your apps fly. More LG 3G stuff. I think this might have... No. I thought it might have a screen protector of some sort in it, but no. It's just a flyer about the thing. It's very glossy, though. Look how glossy that is. It makes all the little phone images pop off the page. kind of like that. Like, I don't know if you can see it on the back, but just these are glossed. So, it's, yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, again, that was probably from the Day Zero bag. Uh, Sprout by HP gave us a little flyer, a little butterfly. We were supposed to come back and talk to him, and we never did. Uh, Lenovo Party gave us this little Share It thing. as uh, their new app that they launched. Uh, it's supposed to be, I guess, sort of like Dropbox. Uh, it's a mass file uh, transfer program. Um, I think you have to be on the same network though, or like within range of somebody to use it. Don't remember all the details, but check it out. It's called Share It. Uh, this was a little card they gave us for details on how to enter into a contest to get a free tablet, I think. The winner got a tablet. Um, I don't know if they handed out that night or if they were going to make the announcement. I didn't stay till the very end of the party, unfortunately, because Someone got locked out of the room, and we had to leave early to go let them back in. Um, so I missed, like, the last hour of the party. So they may have handed them out then. I might have won and not been there to claim it, and who knows. Uh, what is this? Oh, this was the guys from Trident Design. Uh, make a lot of cool items. Uh, check them out. Uh, a lot of crowdfunding things. Um, yeah, but looking at their website, they got a lot of cool things on there, uh, like the hot dog slicer. Uh, check out the video for that. Um, or the pictures on Instagram. I have an Instagram now, in case you didn't know. Uh, so you can check that stuff out there, or at Trident Design. Um, okay, somehow I got two of those. <laughs> also on their table was this little ad for Twinit. Uh, this little photo booth type of thing. Uh, just not a booth, but like the pillars type of thing. Um, check them out. Uh, got a flyer for another smartwatch. Don't really remember talking to them, but I think someone just handed me this in passing. A lot of people do that. They'll stand outside the door and be like, hey, would you like our flyer here? Would you like our flyer? And you just grab them to be nice. Um, but you don't actually stop to talk to them unless it's something that interests you. Uh, it's a business card from the guys at um, Sengold, the light skies. Uh, radius card probably came with the uh, thing, so there's that. A uh, flyer for the O-Box. Um, don't know what the O-Box is. It's a new gaming system. It looked pretty cool. Uh, graphics um, for the game that they had there. I don't know if it's just because it's an older game or if that's just the limits of their system. They had a lot of other stuff that looked really cool, so I don't think it's limits of the system. I think it was just the game. Um, again, like one of their portable handheld devices was actually 3D, which is kind of cool. Uh, so, yeah, check out Obox. Might be the gaming system in the future. Might replace your Wii U's and your 
Xbox Ones, which is actually the Xbox Three, which makes no sense. Um, or your PS4, is that the other one? I don't remember. <laughs> so anyway, the last flyer here uh, is for AT&T U-verse. Uh, I don't know why I got this one either, but those are the flyers. Um, uh, other than the other ones that were in the other bag that I missed. So that's it. Uh, wow, nine minutes. I might have to chop this one up into two parts. I only want to make just a video about the flyers, though. Um, yeah, I'll just leave it. You guys will watch it, right? Uh, so anyway, that's it for the swag bags. Hopefully the audio picked up good on this. I uh, haven't been checking them as I go. I've just been trying to get them done. If I stop to check the audio, the roommates show up, and then I have to do it the last one another day. I got a different shirt, blah, 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 blah. Um, sounds like someone's coming up the stairs. So I'm going to wrap this up. Again, as always, thanks for watching. It was another awesome year at CES. A lot of cool stuff came out of it. And, uh, yeah, so until next year or in my next video, depending on what you watch first, as always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next video.